a draw at Ipswich for Ruben Amorim's Premier League debut as Manchester United's manager. Let's look at the various reactions and how it went. Roy Keane's opinion. The lack of attacking threat is a huge problem for Manchester United. It's not good enough. There's a lack of quality in the final third. I thought Ipswich were going to win, which is a problem. We saw the shape of the team, but it's the same players and same problems. We talk about leopards and spots. Lack of goals and lack of quality in the second half. Ipswich looked the better team. It's his first game. A lot to take in, and it has been a mental week for him, but ultimately, he will be disappointed. Ruben Amorim's view. The players overthought things. It's a tough game. We lost balls without being under pressure. We need to control the ball and the game's tempo. We can't do that right now, but they tried. The Portuguese coach highlighted how much he has had to speak to the media since arriving at Manchester. I've spoken more this week than I have in four years at Sporting. And when you talk too much and don't win, it's hard for everyone. I just want to work with my players, but I understand this is a different world here. On the players covering only 102 kilometers, the second lowest total of the season. We had two training sessions, so the players are a bit confused. If you don't move, you don't run. You defend, but you don't run, and it shows in the data. First of all, they need to understand the game better and improve physically. We need time. On Bruno Fernandes as captain. Bruno Fernandes improved his game by playing closer to the ball. He can make long passes for us, but we can't always keep him there because he always wants to make long passes. Amarim, who brought on both of his center forwards in the second half, noted, at the end of the game with two strikers, Xerxes must understand he needs to get into the box for crosses. Everyone was curious to see what system the Portuguese coach would employ. True to his preference, Amarim set up his team in a 3-4-3 formation, or 3-4-2-1, depending on interpretation. Andre Onana, who made spectacular saves to keep the Red Devils in the match, was in goal. Johnny Evans, Matais De Ligt, and Mazraoui played in defense. Casemiro and Christian Eriksen formed the central midfield duo with Diogo Dalot on the left and Ahmad Diallo on the right. Garnacho, Bruno Fernandes and Rashford made up the attacking trio for Amarim's debut. Everything started well with a brilliant run from Ahmad Diallo, who left two defenders behind to set up Rashford for the opening goal in the second minute. But Hutchinson equalized for Ipswich before halftime. Amorim's thoughts on the system. Everyone talks about the 3-4-3, but that's not the issue. We mainly need to improve our understanding of the game. It was really tough for them. They were thinking about what they needed to do instead of it flowing naturally, which is normal after only two training sessions. But they made great efforts. There's still a lot of room for improvement. I'm happy because they tried, but they can do much better. We started well, but we should have kept possession better. Sometimes we had the ball in defense and the other players were stuck because they weren't sure where to be. They need time to find that fluidity in their play. Amarim on his Premier League debut. It's an incredible atmosphere, a great spectacle, but when the game starts, I feel like I'm back in Portugal, or even the third division. I'm so focused that it all feels the same. You're lucky to have the best league in the world. I'm very happy to be here, but today less so, because I like winning games. The Portuguese manager is here to take risks. There are two options. Either we forget these new ideas, though I believe they're why I was brought in mid-season, or we start implementing them now, take risks, suffer a bit, and be better by this time next season. Thank you for watching the video. Stay tuned for upcoming Europa League match analysis. See you next time.